Hi, I'm Lesser from Jewel, and this is Cathode. He has helped me a lot creating the prototype of Teleport, and has also helped a small team working on Medium. Medium is an audiovisual performance program using Jewel's own framework, and a real version one of Teleport will also use this framework. Cathode will help me from inside a Medium scene controlled by Teleport to explain where all this is going. And then this guy will explain things further for those watching the video a second time. The teleport set is already loaded, so let's get to it. So first I'll open a medium scene and go into full screen mode. We are now in a real-time 3D world and I'm moving the camera around much like you would in a computer game. But apart from the camera, everything is being controlled by teleport. Right now you can see the antennas react into the audio of the delay effect as well as a bunch of things triggered directly by the MIDI pad. Let's zoom out and change the style a bit and also spread those cubes around. Now, as I press play on the iPad, a single augmented sequence will play and you will both hear and see that when I play a new key on the keyboard, it will change the bass note of the sequence as well as change the direction that Kitty is walking. So, I made a MIDI loop of that input, and when I change the duration slider for the sequence on the iPad, again you will both hear and see that sound and visuals, which are not typical loops at all, change to something more abrupt. This becomes even more apparent when I change to a camera controlled by a teleport and start to play a triggered sequence using the notes from my second keyboard. Together with the magic knob I'm turning here, I could go on for quite some time, but I'll just record another MIDI loop so that the triggered sequence will keep playing by itself. Both sequencing columns, and therefore all we are seeing and hearing, is controlled by the same movable time module, making it easy changing the timing of everything using a single time slider on the iPad. Back at straight timing, I'll turn back up the duration so he will move smoothly again. Then hear and watch everything go into slow motion as I turn down the BPM on the iPad. So far, this has all been quite live, looped and augmented. Nothing would sound or look the same twice. But here I start an actual sequence, so let's watch the audiovisual outcome. I'll just change a patch on a synth using the iPad, and back on the sequencing tab, you will see in a moment that the first long sequence that is playing starts a shorter looping sequence that will make the kitty swim for the rest of the long sequence. I won't go into detail about how this is all set up, but everything is being controlled completely by the three modules my little helper has shown you, as well as two connected time modules. As we go into a screen capture, notice how the kitty really is being lit by the colored spheres. Again, that's 256 real-time, fully 3D lights in this scene. Live, I'm really only turning one knob here, which opens up a third drone and applies a post-processing effect with that same amount modified by the audio of the delay effect. That was the sequence, and a preview of where Duel is headed. To finish off, I will show you a few clips from videos you can watch to learn more about what can be done with Teleport 092 and the Teleport Control app. They have the form of jams, but really are constructed demos with annotations that explain a wide range of functionalities. Here you see how the step modules previously seen in the screen captures are fully functional on the iPad as well, including storing and naming new presets. The same video fluidly evolves from there to here and like most teleport videos, show that once you have looped what is playing real time with the master audio looper, it takes over giving you time to load up a completely different environment with new instruments, effects, assignments and module presets. Teleport's unique instrument and effect slots handle both hardware and software patches. 
Once loaded, you can mix that in much like a DJ, using a specialized mixer effects system. The difference of course being that it's not a static track at all, but rather a new unique setup with its own unique sound. The demo makes yet another complete teleportation to this place and now shows how the app on iPhone can be used to control the auto loopers on the individual channels. That is explored further in the Instrumentalist Companion video, where this track is built up using live looping of bass, trombone, vocoder and synth, with a few rhythmic parts brought in later on with perfect synchronization. For more info, just follow the links. And thanks for watching. Please share and support the development of Teleport and Medium.